Welcome back. You're tuned into your Feel Good Breakfast Show. This is Expresso only on SABC3. Now, just before the break, we spoke to JJ Anderson, a model and a host of a very popular martial arts TV channel. And right now, we're sticking with that genre because we're talking to a man who is very well known in the action and martial arts film circles and seen as a leader in the genre, of, uh, in the genre with franchises like Mortal Kombat under his belt, which really toppled the box office. I'm talking about Larry Kasson, our film and TV producer for Threshold Entertainment Group. And he's here this morning to share some of his insights into the genre that really captured millions of people. Larry, so nice to be ta chatting to you this morning and welcome to Cape Town. Thanks, a blast to be here. How's First your time. stay been? It's been great. It's lovely. It's beautiful. Now, let's talk a bit about your career. Um, you've been a producer for films like Dirty Dancing. Um, we have Terminator 2 as well, but I think the big one we're talking about here is the Mortal Kombat franchise. Right. I mean, what contributed to, to, con contributed to the success of this incredible, incredible movie? Well, you know, we did Mortal Kombat. Everyone told me my career was going to be over because no one had ever <laughs> successfully made a movie from a video game. Mm. And the first time I played the, the arcade game, I said to the guy who owned the arcade company, if you give me the rights, because he didn't believe it could be done, I'll produce it in every medium in the world, movies, TV, animation, live theater. That was my bet to him, and he did, and we did. Yeah, and like I said, it absolutely toppled the box office. Yep. And it, I mean, what was the grossing, grossing value the, for the, the franchise? At, at, at the revenue of, at, at retail, the, the franchise yeah. is, a, the gross revenue is $5 billion now. $5 billion. Still counting. Still, <laughs> still, uh, still counting. Yeah, yeah. If we take a look at South Africa and the martial arts, the MMA especially, I mean, right. it's really been growing vastly, very quickly over the past number of years. Why do you think that is? And why do you think this kind of genre captures millions of viewers every single day? MMA is the fastest growing sport in the world. And martial arts, sports and entertainment is successful for two reasons. It's a blast to watch. I mean, mm. it's visceral, it's fun, guys jumping all over the place. But at its core, it's about empowerment. You don't have to be the biggest one in your block to win. Mm. And that confidence that comes from knowing if you do the right thing and train and focus, yeah. you can win, carries over to other parts of your life. Mm. So it makes you feel great if you do it. It really does work. Mm. So there's really truth in the fact that after you watch a kung fu movie, you want to go out there and you know, start your own movie. <laughs> well, do, do don't do thing. what I did as a kid, which is watch my first <laughs> kung fu movie and trying to flip the neighbor kid. And You, know, you see? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I think you all did that. But yeah. if you learn, it's phenomenal. And that's yeah. why we started a whole martial arts television network called Black mm. Belt TV around the world. We're in 50 countries now just mm. to do martial arts. Our motto is kicks, mm. flicks, and chicks, because the whole point is there's so much fun of martial arts, mm. it's sports, it's entertainment, and it's lifestyle. Mm. It's like nothing else. Now, you're down here in Cape Town to check out the Cape Fight League, who will be yeah. featuring on your channel. Yes. How did you get to know about this Fight League? Well, one of the cool things about having a TV channel in 50 countries is our goal is to bring martial arts from the world to the world. Mm. So when we come to Africa, with Black Belt TV, we find some great stuff, like Cape Fight League, which we've now signed up, and we're not only gonna show them in South Africa and Africa, but all over the world. So we look for the greatest fighters in the world, and then we show them to the rest of the world. Brilliant, Larry, yeah. thank you so much for joining us this My morning, pleasure. man. I think it's so interesting what you do, and also, I mean, you're traveling up to Johannesburg now? We're going back to Joburg, for the, and then uh, we have an appointment with it, and it's yet to be named Elephant this weekend. And, and then we're going back to LA. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant, Larry, thank you so much, all man, right. really appreciate it. Larry Kasanoff, film and television producer for Threshold Entertainment Group. Now, talking about Movies right now, here's your top five box office hits.